everyone, Craig Lackless. Um, today I want to teach you um, the Summer Moans, uh, I Want to Be Sedated. It's a great song, a really easy song too. Uh, so hit that like button and subscribe, hit the button down there, subscribe to me. Um, and we'll have some videos for you all the time. I'm going to try to at least do one video a week. Um, so let's get started on this. Um, so this is going to be the key of F. Actually, bring it down to E. So I think it's actually in a key of F. I'm gonna do a key of E. It's more common, I think. You know, so everything rings out nicer. Got those open stuff. And we do the solo. We can, we can ring it out open. Uh, so okay. So let's get started. So we're gonna do uh, E octaves here. Okay. So if you don't know what octaves are. I have a video on octaves and um, a video on bar chords and uh, so what we're going to use in this, this song is we're going to use octaves, bar chords and uh, a thing I call one and threes which is just the beginning, the bottom end of the, the bar chords. Okay, so uh, I'll put some links down in the description so any of you who don't know what those are. So let's get started on this. So we're going to go, we're going to play some octaves here. So the octaves are going to be, uh, this is the E octave here, and it's going to be our first finger is going to be on the fifth string, seventh fret, and our uh, third finger is going to be on the third string, uh, ninth fret. So, we're, and then we're not playing, we're not playing the, uh, the fourth string right there. We're going to mute that when we lay our finger over this string lightly. And uh, and I put my finger lightly on the sixth string here too, so it doesn't ring out like that. So. I just want the high part. I don't want the bass ringing out. I want the... Okay, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to do that. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. So when we do the octave, we're going to jump to the A, which is the 5th fret, the 6th string. Those are the 1 and 3's in the bar chord thing I'll tell you about. We're going to play a bar chord, there's a complete bar chord, there's the 1 and 3 cheat chords. So, so, do what you want. figure out what you want to do um sounds really nice on the electric of course i'm showing you on acoustic because i just i i never like plug in at home so uh anyway so, all right, so that's the first couple chords Which is the uh, seventh fret. So it's going to be B to E. And the B is going to be on scale two, which is going to be seven and nine on the uh, fifth and fourth strings. So what we do there. So I'm going to bounce back from the B to E. Then it goes. All right, so I'm going to tell you what that was. So we're going to go E. Well, E to A. Sorry, I'm going to watch my stupid dog here. Stupid dog. So 
that twice. So E A B E A B twice. Then it goes. So now we're gonna go F to F sharp, which is gonna be on the fourth and fifth strings, and we're gonna have our uh, first finger on the uh, eighth fret of the fifth string, and our third finger is gonna be on the tenth fret of the fourth string, and we're gonna slide up to ninth. So I'll say Yeah, again, it's just cheesy. Okay, so when he does that, now they're going into They're doing the same thing they did earlier, but now they're only doing it up another step. So they're going from E to uh, F sharp. See that? And you can play stuff down here too. But let's, we're going to do it like the album here. So we're going to. Okay, so like I said, we're doing the same thing we were doing earlier, but it's up a key. So now the, so this key's going to be F sharp. To, to B, to B, right to F sharp, then it's going to be, right here, that's going to be C, uh, C sharp, it's going to be uh, on your ninth, no, is that ninth, yeah, ninth, ninth fret, um, so we're going to go nine, to, to go C sharp to F sharp, C sharp to F sharp, C sharp to F sharp, B, C sharp. That's it. Let's do this. So we're going to go F sharp. four times on the end there. So let's get to the solo. The solo is going to be the first one. I want this on the E. He's going to go. So what I'm doing there is I, I just slide up from three to five on the second string. You can, I use my third finger. And I hit the, the open. That's why I like to do it. And that's because uh, this key because you hit the open. So this is another cheesy, easy solo, but like make it yours, make it, put some feeling into it, so it's, it's gonna sound cheesy if you make it cheesy, so. I kind of add that, add that at the end there, when it's over like that. See, this is what it's playing, it's playing over this. So I go. At the end, they go. And there's a double note bend there. Um, I have a video on double note bends too, so check that out. So it's gonna just go. I'm gonna bend from. Uh, I'm actually bending like this seven here on the second string to the nine. Also, see it? I'm gonna go. And I'm hitting. Uh, I'm bending it. So when it bends. Full bend here on the seventh to the, and then I'm gonna pick the first string, the seventh fret too. Back to, back to the five. Okay, so then the next solo when they switch keys, you're gonna go instead of five, you're gonna go uh, up to the seven. I end it like that. Okay, so if you have two guitars, you can play that lead and. Thing there, but that's uh, that's it, it's pretty simple. So, have fun.